That's a black hole. One of the strangest and most powerful mysteries in the universe. But not all black holes are the same. Some are born from dying stars, others might be as old as the universe itself, and a few exist only in theory. Today, we'll explore the five main types of black holes, from the smallest to the most massive. Stellar black holes. These are the most common kind, born when giant stars reach the end of their lives. When a massive star runs out of fuel, it collapses under its own gravity and explodes as a supernova. What's left behind is a point of infinite density, a black hole. A stellar black hole can be no bigger than a city, yet way up to a hundred times more than our sun. We can find them by detecting X-rays from hot gas falling into them, or by spotting how nearby stars move under their gravity. One famous example is Cygnus X1, the first confirmed black hole in history. Intermediate black holes. If stellar black holes are small and supermassive ones are enormous, then logic says something must exist in between. These are the intermediate black holes, mysterious objects that might weigh hundreds or thousands of suns. But finding them is incredibly difficult. They don't shine like quasars or roar like stellar mergers. They hide quietly in star clusters or small faint galaxies. Scientists believe they could be the missing link that explains how small black holes grow into the colossal ones that shape galaxies. They are the bridge between beginnings and ends in the cosmic story. Supermassive black holes. Now we meet the true rulers of the universe. Black holes so immense that their masses reach millions or even billions of suns. They sit at the heart of nearly every galaxy. At the center of our Milky Way lies Sagittarius A, weighing about four million suns. And in the galaxy, M87 lives a monster six billion times heavier, the one whose glowing ring was captured in the first ever photograph of a black hole in 2019. These titans don't just consume matter. They shape galaxies, controlling how stars are born and how galaxies evolve. Without them, the universe as we know it might not even exist. Primordial black holes. Here we step into the realm of possibility. Some scientists believe that black holes may have existed before the first stars were born, forming just moments after the Big Bang. In that chaotic beginning, when the universe was incredibly dense, tiny regions may have collapsed directly into black holes. These are called primordial black holes. Here, yeah, some could be smaller than an atom, but heavier than a mountain. They might even explain one of the greatest mysteries in science, dark matter. Perhaps the invisible glue holding galaxies together isn't made of strange particles, but of countless microscopic black holes drifting through space. Quantum black holes. Now we've reached the very edge of physics. Here, Einstein's theory of relativity collides with quantum mechanics. Imagine a black hole the size of a subatomic particle, unimaginably dense, evaporating in an instant through a process known as Hawking radiation. These quantum black holes represent the meeting point between gravity and the quantum world. If proven to exist, they could bring us closer to the ultimate goal of physics, a theory of everything, explaining both the infinitely large and the infinitely small. But the story doesn't end there. There are other strange ideas, like binary black holes, pairs that orbit each other for billions of years before colliding and sending ripples through space-time itself, what we now call gravitational waves. And then there's the theoretical white hole, the mirror opposite of a black hole, where nothing enters, only matter bursts out. No one has ever seen one, but the idea alone stretches our imagination beyond the edge of reality. In the end, black holes are not just symbols of destruction. They are gateways to understanding creation itself, showing us how the universe began, evolved, and maybe how it will end. They remind us that even in the darkest corners of space, there is wonder, mystery, and beauty waiting to be discovered. So tell me, which type of black hole amazed you the most? Share your thoughts in the comments, and don't forget to subscribe. Our next journey will take us even deeper into the unknown.